It is the 41st millennium, and mankind rules the stars. This sprawling empire is powered by hive worlds. Gargantuan planets of industry. Necromunda is the greatest hive world in all of the Imperium. With cities that rise from the ash wastes. Like sheer mountain peaks. Spire upon spire. Tower upon tower. The hives climb so far above the poisoned clouds, they cleave the heavens. And what nightmares may come in these hive cities, where humanity has been allowed to grow unchecked in its teeming billions. Builders run the Underhive. Without the Merchant's Guild, there's no order to life down here. No one to stop things unraveling completely. You're thinking there's no order down here anyway. But you just don't see it. Order is what every ganger down here is looking for. Just an order they can change. One where they can get to be top dog. The big boss man. Not just a pro laboring away, toiling for house high in the throne. Order down here is different. Nobody wants the enforcers, or worse, coming down here, trying to make things the way they are up in Hive City. So we all follow the Gilders' rules. Without them, it all breaks down. No one kills a Gilder unless they're truly dangerous or truly desperate. And the truly desperate are the most dangerous of all. That's why I think we can help each other out. We're going to earn ourselves that bounty for taking down whoever killed Maro Virax. And we're going to put things back the way they should be. You see, we're agents of order, the likes of us. Even if we do get to so a little strife along the way. You're in? Trust me. It'll be worth it.
This is it. Yeah. You sure? Positive. The black serpents are holed up in there. You sure about this? Sure they're in there or sure about getting it done? Relax. It's just a few eschews. Then, payday. And then, payday. Okay. But be ready for anything. We are. They can't defend all the approaches. Or coming from both sides and from the dome. Floor. You two. This level. I'm heading down. You in the house, right? Yeah. Okay, this is it. Let's go. I can see the sentries. Wait until I'm on the ground, then take out as many as you can. Let them know they're surrounded. Let the hunt begin. So this is Escher territory. Open this rust damn door!
I'm in. Let's do it. See you at the prize. Plenty. Keep going. Those good lives are pathetic.
class! Hurry! I don't like this! Should have done this alone. Knew it. Always work alone. Let the brute have a little fun. 
Who's there? Oh, you know me. Damn. Jericho. Where am I? Martyr's End. Martyr's End? Martyr's End. Beyond Thorian's Dome, beyond the bad zones of Delta Seven, far from where you want to be, I'll wager. But a better place than you'd be in otherwise, I can assure you. Better than I would be if I hadn't met you. I saved your life. Feels like you did a great job. I suppose it all depends on what you imagine being dead feels like. You seem keener than you should be on finding out. Enough of the riddles, Spire Boy. What happened? <laughs> There's time for all that later. You're gonna hurt yourself straining like that? Remember, you only just made it this far. I'm gonna leave you with my friend here. There's a watering hole right outside, the Blessed Temple, they call it. You can find me there when you're ready. Ready for what? That's the fun part. Finding out. Who are you? What is this place? I'm Malakachian. You may call me Malak. I'm a chirurgeon, and this is my surgery. You're lucky to be here. Damn. A rogue doc. If you prefer. Yes. What did you do to me? Nothing I didn't have to. Well, maybe a little more than I had to. That's a most impressive set of bionics. They would have been a pleasure to work with. But for all the bleeding flesh getting in the way. Thanks. I'm sure there used to be more of it. Your friend is right. Cal Jericho? He's not my friend. Well, he was right. You should have died. It's only those bionics of yours that saved you. But still, there was a lot of damage. It will take you a little while to heal. And a little while to get used to the changes. What? A few adjustments. An internal reservoir. A cerebral implant. You'll find they're all improvements, once you get used to them. A cerebral implant? Where the hell did that come from? From your friend, Cal Jericho. He's not my friend. Oh, I'd say he is now. These bionics, once you have healed, they will allow you to do incredible things. But there might be a few adjustments I need to make. Nothing works first time. Not when you're working with materials like these, anyway. You should come back and see me when you're ready to find out what you're really capable of. Thank you.